What do you get when you take Overwatch, World of Warcraft, Fortnite, and, I don't know, League of Legends, mixed in the giant vat together with a smidge of bourbon and a lot of fetal alcohol syndrome? Well, you get Realm Royale. It is um, this multiplayer travesty that came up with free. I don't know who the fuck made this, but it's clearly the brainchild of a fevered dream and a whole concoction of who, who knows what kind of drugs and alcohol. This game is fucking weird, and I love it. I, I fucking love it. I don't know what to tell you. I, I just cannot get over this game. The game, I, I don't know how I feel about it, but it's great. It's like this weird Twilight Zone parallel universe where instead of getting all those good games, we get this fucking absolute holy grail of a nightmare. So all plagiarism aside, is it a good game? The graphics look exactly like World of Warcraft, the game that came out 15 years ago now. So already we're off to a bad start. It's uh, very inconsistent too. Some places look actually amazing. I'm like shitting my pants. It's so good. And then other places look like a fucking pixely mess. Orgy of pixels that look just goddamn awful. I don't know. Uh, it's, uh, I'm fucking flabbergasted. Some of the inconsistency, but it's, it's crazy. So let's start off with the good because we can probably brush through that in like 30 seconds. Minute tops. All right. The music is dope. Music is sick. Listen to that shit. All right, that gets me fucking hyped. That is crazy. Uh, downfall, there seems to only be one song that just loops over and over again. But um, you know what they say? Uh, if it ain't broke, don't make more of it. I don't know. Don't teach a man to fish. I, 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 I don't know. It, it works. It gets the job done. Um, just like the art. The art's pretty cool. There seems to also only be one picture. There it is. It's kind of cool. Um, but that's all you get. So enjoy. Uh, gameplay. This is where we already start to uh, come into a little bit of a downhill spiral. Um, everything's just a little weird. Jumping is floaty. Aiming is real weird. You kind of got to like pull your shots, like, but you can't. It's, it's, I mean, I can hit shots, but, uh, it doesn't make the most sense. It doesn't feel as satisfying as other games. It feels okay though, I guess. Yeah, movement is static. It feels exactly like God, it feels exactly like World of Warcraft from 20 years ago, wherever the fuck it was. Like that kind of like jumping around. Like it's not. It, we've come a long way since then, is what I'm trying to say. And this one is just an homage to the past. Besides that, the gameplay is literally just another generic. Battle Royale game. It's literally a rip off of Fortnite to just cash in on the, the craze. Which, don't get me wrong. I have zero power. I'm, I'm not going to say, hey, don't make yours. I'm not going to sit here and say that. Because you know what? If I could sell out, I would. Problem is I can't. Alright, so make some money. But um, it feels a little rushed. It does feel like there's a, a, a somebody's like, this is somebody's baby. It does feel like there's a lot of cool things to it. Somebody put time and effort into it. It just also simultaneously feels like there was also no time and it was completely rushed out the door to make a product. You might think those things are contradictory, but somehow I tell you, play the game and you'll, uh, you'll quickly find out how that makes sense. They have made some improvements and made some D d improvements unprovements to um the battle royale scene first off when you're you're jumping off the boat uh bor fucking barge ufo i don't know when you're jumping off the, the sh pirate ship that floats through the air instead of parachuting down like a little fucking baby you, you fly through the goddamn atmosphere and ground pound the goddamn earth bare knuckled like you're one of the goddamn avengers and instead of waiting 20 minutes like goddamn Fortnite to fucking parachute in you're just bam right in the action and you know what it gives you a knife right off the bat which is basically useless but it's more than nothing i suppose it's pretty much nothing but it's more than nothing um do you prove when you die instead of just dying getting revived like every other game in the history of games keeping it straightforward because we kind of figured it out many years ago uh instead of that you turn into a fucking chicken literally look at this shit you run you fucking turn into a chicken you run around and after like 15 seconds or whatever god knows hell you you turn back into a person with like 
half your health. So whenever you kill someone, you have to chase them a goddamn round. You know, people can be fighting you. So if you're in a squads and there's, like, you kill somebody, there's chickens running around, like, they could be revived and you have to worry about the other people. It's like a fucking mess. I don't know who's... God damn, I don't know if it was, like, casual Friday and the crew showed up drunk and they were, like, late pitch, pitching ideas, trying to get stuff steamrolled. And they're like, you know what? I'm 50 years old and completely out of touch. You know what's funny? Chickens. Kids love fucking funny random shit. Let's throw some chickens in there. I guess. So kudos to that guy for shitting the bed on that. I will admit the LOL was worth it for about five seconds until you realize that it's actually a nightmare to deal with. Especially, yeah, if you're playing squads and they've got hundreds of chickens running around and then you can just get away. I mean, it's good on the other side, I guess. If you get down, you can just fucking fly around like an asshole. And uh, pretty much that's the base of the game. There's some cool stuff from the other components. You can have different classes. You can be a mage or a warrior. I don't know the fucking difference. But uh, it's cool that they have that, I suppose. Um, it's not like I can fucking concoct spells. There are cool weapons. Weapons are kind of cool. You can have, like, mage's staffs and shit. Um, they just fire, like, normal guns, so it's whatever. But uh, it's something, I suppose. The island's kind of cool. There's a great variety. Biomes, I guess, is what I can call it. Like, it's actually... It's pretty sweet... Some places actually look really cool. It does it do, it does remind me of old fashioned World of Warcraft. It's got all these places. It's pretty sweet. Besides that, it's pretty I don't want to say generic, but um that's all there is. There's little power-ups. Like, ooh, you press O and then you you fucking turn invisible for three seconds. It's not groundbreaking stuff, but it's there. Um you can forge stuff at this forge. I played the tutorial and I still barely understand it. You can just go up and like you get like little gems, I suppose. And you and you use that to uh, craft weapons, I guess. You craft all I do all I do is craft healing potions and they only let you do one and then I fuck off. But um again, it's something to change up the gameplay. Uh I've never come anywhere close to winning. I think the closest I've done is like top 8. And yet I can't fucking, like, when I play it, I literally just pick it up, play it for, like, half hour, and I just have a blast, because it's so fucking stupid. It's so stupid. I absolutely love this. Uh, this one is definitely an 8 out of 10, or at least a 7.5 out of 10. You know, you won't, you play this, you won't forget it. At least in my opinion. Alright, cool, thanks, bye.